Hey everybody, Curzy's here. Welcome back to Until We Die. So I'm gonna show you guys on normal how to have both sides up to tier up to up to the tier six walls and have stalkers before day seven. And most of what I'm telling you can be translated over to seasoned, but with a, a huge exception. So you're gonna start off. Obviously, you're gonna gather this and give the. Uh, we got here his gears. You're gonna start building that and use the other two guys to scavenge that. Scavenging on day one, it's more important than building things. So just scavenge as much as you can. Wait for these guys. One of them become available here. And then send them in. Now, generally, as a rule of thumb for me, if one of these two selections is not combat training, which here it is, I suggest you restart and reload the game because combat training makes this so much easier. Okay. Anyway, so. You're gonna go ahead and start building this wall and scavenge this pile. Uh, and then you're gonna finish building this wall. And now that pile of mushrooms over there will, um, it will be done. You know, it'll be auto harvested. That's what I'm trying to say. You're going to harvest those three, and then you're going to come over here. Harvest that. And then you're going to harvest this, too. All right. And then you're going to harvest this one. And then you're going to go back home. Now, the best thing about Anna is her passive. Which is amazing. And then you're gonna start harvesting this pile. And you're gonna wait until nighttime falls so this guy doesn't stop harvesting this pile. Only enemies will spawn from the left, and the wall you put up will hold them off without any defenders. Alright, now you can, after she says that, you can go over here. And we're going to wait for this to be finished. And we are actually going to create an engineer. I know that feels like a waste of two population, but it's not. So we create that engineer and start researching. Research is so important. And now we have that guy, that pile all, all scavenged. And now here is the hand cart with both a digger and a commoner. So harvest up the scrap. Send him back off. And then quickly come over here and harvest this pile. Start building that wall. Scavenge this up. Remember, this is just for normal. Um, I'll cover seasoned, how I get it done real fast and seasoned. Uh, on another video. Alright, come with me. Start building this. The, uh, the shovel hut. Alright, come with me. We're not going to create the shovel hut. Or make a shoveler. Or a digger. We're actually going to start harvesting this first. And start harvesting that. This pile of mushrooms won't be here unseasoned, but since it's here, you can harvest it if you want.
But I'm actually going to bring my guys over here to harvest that. All right, looking good. And you come with me, friend. You start taking care of that. Come on, harvest that. And then you harvest that. Always harvest the dead bodies for the research. It's way more important than uh, anything else. We'll start this up. And then we have our good friend, the handcart. Send him back off. And then we're going to create one more digger. And then we're going to bring him over here. And now, because of combat training, diggers clear the wall twice as fast. And now we're going to build that, but I want them to harvest this. And now by building that wall, though, we are also preventing the growth from spawning over here. Which gives us more time. Hurry, 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 hurry. All right, and now that we have four walls out, we can choose our expansion. On normal, I suggest barbed wire. On seasoned and above, Flashbang. Okay, all you guys get over here. Repair that wall. While I wait for... I have enough time, I think. So we're actually just going to come over here. Oh, there's no growth. Okay. That, that I, I thought there might be growth there, and uh, we take care of it. Take care of the eggs, I mean. But since there is no growth, no eggs, on season there probably will be a growth. So just go over there to take care of the eggs. And get research going for the next level. Go ahead and harvest this. This won't be here unseasoned. But at the very least... Oops. There we go. And then use both your diggers to start clearing this wall. Now on seasoned, on seasoned, you will not be spreading off to the left, but on normal, this is possible because there's plenty of scrap to go around. But since uh, the handcart just came in, we're gonna use the diggers to uh, come over here and send them off real fast. And we're going to create a third digger. Hey, fellas. Now, the reason we're clearing this, though, is because we want the dead body that's behind here. Because we want to get the uh, research. Thank you. And we're going to take you and we're going to turn you into an engineer. Do, 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 do. Get your stamina all the way back up. Being able to run is really good. Don't clear that. Clear this. But we can go ahead and start uh, harvesting this. Now, you don't need to clear off the ammunition factory until you have stalkers. Because it's not really going to matter. Go ahead and clear that. On normal, this guy will be here, but on seasoned or above, he will not.
And then you're gonna come over here, clear this one. And clear these guys so you get the food. And then come over here and clear this. Check for our growth over here. All right, looks good. Give me these guys. And there we go. And then we're going to build that. And then we'll come over here and finish clearing this up. Wow, we actually cleared this up on day three. I'm impressed with myself. And there we go. Now, normally I'd say on seasoned, you would build that, build the uh, food farm, but you don't need to just yet because I have plenty of food. So we don't need to worry about that. What we need to worry about is getting back to the hand cart here and take care of uh, sending him off. And we'll create our fourth digger here. <sighs> and we'll build that wall here because we can. On normal, it's easy to build stuff like that. Do, 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 do. And always look at your uh, population. There we go. And so by day three now, we will no longer have any this by this time now. We won't have any uh, enemies spawning on the right side. Now clear that. Oh, technology. Ow, oh, technology. If technology is done, you have to go get it. I wasn't paying attention. There we go. Come back with me, fellas. Uh, go ahead and clear off the cement factory because it is actually more important. Go ahead and clear the mushrooms. Again, all mushrooms, very good to clear. Oh, okay, so now we have more, uh... More people. Yep. Now, uh, as far as population goes, remember, the hand cart will always bring you back one population that puts you over your cap. And of course, now we're spreading on the is on normal. We're spreading all the way over to the tier six wall because we can't. I just need to get my there we go. Get my stamina back. Hana, 
As always, clear these things out of the way. Always harvest the dead bodies. And then come on over here, clear this thing out of the way. And then check for growths. Which we have one, so we're gonna clear it. Clear this. Why did that, that double spawn like that? Alrighty. No, you guys continue. Oh, it's done. My bad. There we go. This will make sure that that spawn point disappears. Let's go. Because we just got the uh, the handcart back. Do -do 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 -do. Now, like I said, on seasoned, you won't be able to really do it like this, but at the same time, it's all right. And now because this research here is almost done, we're gonna make another engineer. And we're gonna build that because our population is maxed out. Come on guys. Alright, alright, alright. I need to come back over this way. I need to grab one of the engine. I should have brought the other engineer with me. I wasn't thinking. Really quickly, 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 quickly. Yep. Go, 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 go. And then we're gonna build the, uh, the storage. The scrap storage. Storage house, whatever it is. And then we're also gonna build, uh, start the next research. I was gonna say, what's all my engineers? Start the research, build the storage. Then the handcart should be back on just in time for the storage house to be completed and therefore drop off more scrap for you. And then you're just going to take all your guys here and you're going to find all the scrap that you did not, uh, did not take. And activate all of the, uh, the barrels that you didn't activate. Oh, come on. There we go. Alright, fellas. And like I said, though, you don't need to build these until you think you need food. But you can build them early. It, it probably is suggested you build them early. And look at that, and there's our man. Anyways, uh, and when you build the warehouse, go for barricades. I don't ever see a world where sorting is more efficient than having more health on your walls. 
But maybe there is a world. I don't know. And there we go. And now we need, of course, more, uh... Now, actually, what you're not gonna do, though, is upgrade your, uh... While you have a full pop cap, don't build another tent. Because another tent will make me at 11 out of 10, and we already know that the handcart is going to bring number 11 no matter what. So, we're not gonna worry about that. But what we are gonna do is upgrade the walls. And why not build this? Thank you. Engineers build faster. So we're going to go on a little bit ahead here. Oh, that's right. Watch out for the uh, little wave that comes out of the hole. <laughs> that was my bad. But go ahead and uh, put two, uh, two diggers down on that. And then we're going to move on up ahead. And use the diggers to clear that. Use your commoners to get scrap. Grab the food. Hey, look, there's our man again. Let's go. Yeah, yeah, I left wall, no big deal. Uh, I do have to come back to the left wall, though. We're going to go ahead and make another digger. And get him to work on that. In fact, I think I have to go back now, don't I? Day five is when the first, uh, yeah. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. Day five is when the first little uh, hard-hitting mortar guy pops up. Yeah, I'm aware. Always be aware of that. Day five, always stick by your uh, by your walls. But engineers can now open the walls. But the more important thing here is going to be to start upgrading the generator. And I better have enough to do it. I do. I'll take another engineer. And then what we're going to do now, while the engine, the generator is upgrading, is we're going to go grab these guys. Oh, thank God I didn't get bad RNG. And another... Uh, I said... 
All right, you guys do that. Oh, and we're good. Go. We're going to go collect all the scrap in the room with the plant. Because by the time that happens, the generator should be done upgrading and we should be able to start the uh, like generator is going to be done. All right, finish it. I don't have enough research to start anything, but uh, let's forget. But we're going to select industry because industry is much better. You get more weapons and items produced faster and you just need to. Uh, and if the shop is full, it produces scrap. Anyways, yep, yeah, yeah, yeah. And OK, so we uh, we don't have enough scrap for that. But when we come back around, we will. That's the whole point. Oh, geez. And here comes the, the cart, too. And on season, this, this survivor won't be in here. So grab all the scrap that's in here. And then head back. Get this building. Oh, you know, and while we have um, so much going on here. Oh, I don't have enough. How sad is that? That's fine. Now we're going to need three survivors in total. So we're going to go ahead and sacrifice. Oh, never mind. We're going to sacrifice this one digger. And we're going to go ahead and open up the stalker shop. Grab two stalkers and go. Now, my stalkers look different because I survived until uh, I beat a game on seasoned. So my stalkers do actually have better combat ability. I need to get over to the wall faster. <laughs> the field kitchen is available. And now this is when you want to start upgrading your tents more because the field kitchen now exists. There we go. Put those guys back to work. Do I need these guys for anything? Um, probably not. So we're probably pretty good. So now there is another room on the right side that has um, more uh, more stuff for you. So we're going to go there and we're going to open it up because it's day six, not day seven. And do I have enough to build that? I do. We're going to leave the... Uh, the commoner behind. Let's go ahead and fill back up here. And now if we go all the way over. Oh, hi. We'll get to this. This room is harmless and has a friend in it. Hmm. 
and a dead body. So always pick up the dead body too. Oh. Looks like there was more, uh, more scrap here. Build this. Am I gonna have, uh... I am, actually. I'm gonna wait for them to finish this, because I'm gonna have auto turrets by day seven. <laughs> Alright, come with me. And... I'm gonna see if this guy is gonna spawn a weapon before the wave. Mm, yeah, hard to tell. Oh, I am out of food. I need food for you. Now I'm sure there's plenty of food over on the left, right? And of course you can open up the uh the sniper shop. Mm. There is food over here. Awesome. And because the sniper shop is open, we can take a sniper. And then we can come over here, send him off on his way. Hold on. Thank you. And now let me see if I can't go get a new, uh, a new stalker. All right, go. I did learn auto turrets. So I have auto turrets and stalkers on day seven. So there you go. And it also means, uh, I can take this guy back with me too. Yep, we have another stalker. Hi, rats. Come on, 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 come on. The wall sounds like it's fine right now. Probably because it has auto turrets and stalkers. Hey guys, what you doing? Is that right? And there you go, you have it. And always take the cash. It's extra money and food. And always remember, the next day is always going to have... Oh, yeah, that's right. Take these guys with me, too. The next day is always going to have extra... Um, extra time for you. Thank you. And then, of course, we're going to take the... Uh, take the uh, the commoner I get here and put him in the kitchen. No, we're opening that. Thank you. I don't have enough food again, but that's fine. Oh, that's right. I do have enough food. That's why we took the cash. 
You see how I think ahead like that? Anyway. <laughs> but then we're taking the commoner. And we're going to put him in the kitchen. And the, the kitchen will automatically spawn another commoner for you. So you don't waste a, a pop cap like that. And there you go. That is it. Day eight. And now I can just take my diggers over to the plant, kill the plant, build the thing in, you know, build the uh, the storage room inside the room with the plant, send out a stalker wave or a stalker expedition. And that's the first stalker expedition. And then after that, you just need to send out one more stalker expedition to uh, make sure you have fuel to upgrade the generator again. So that is all the time we have for right now. So if this helped you out, this helped you understand normal mode a little bit better than, you know, than you already did, then hit that like button, comment down below, and I'll do another video on season mode soon. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.